punk ass chef and the garbage omelet. All right, here you go. Just came in from a long day of activity. Actually, no, that's not true. I just woke up and uh, 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 I'm gonna make a big juicy omelet. So what I got here is anything I could possibly find in the kitchen, okay? I just got some leftover vegetables. I'll probably grab some other things lurking around and that will be that. So what you wanna do is come over to your pan. I'm out of breath from that. I am an out of shape punk ass chef. So here we go. Get your flame going nice. Get that nice and hot because when you're cooking uh, veggies and eggs, get a nice flame going, you know? You want to get some nice sizzling and sauteing and just delicious stuff. Okay, so I get some oil, some butter too, but I'm going to start with a little oil for the veggies. And all you do is pour a little bit of oil. You know, you know how to cook up some vegetables. I mean, my like six-year-old nephew can do it if I add one. So we got a few jalapeno seeds in there. I like doing that because, you know, it just gives an extra effort. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so here we go. We're going to cook up some, uh, or cut up some onions real quick, right? You can do it however you want. It doesn't matter. The side doesn't matter. Just do it like that. I like them big, so I'm going to actually just do it like that. My knife is terrible, so you can see they didn't cut that well. Anyway, so something like that, because I like thick onions. Most people probably think I'm crazy. I'm going to throw some mushrooms right in there with it. Kind of mix that around a little bit. Get it going. You can pull out your handy spatula. Oh, it smells good already. So here we go. Next up, we got some jalapenos here. I like to put mine in now because I like to get them a little hotter and really cook them off. Perfect. Grab my eggs while I'm at it. And like we said before, it's a uh, garbage omelet. So anything you possibly could find before you put your eggs in there, Find it, you know? So you got all this stuff right here. Uh, baskets full, of, oh, look at this. I mean, wasabi peas. I mean, come on, seriously? What's better than that? I'm gonna kinda crush it up though, cause they're a little hard and I don't like hard things, unlike some people. So here we go, ready? Done. Don't be afraid to make a mess. Take your wasabi. I'm gonna grab a little tomato in there right now too. Look at that. Beautiful. And you know what just hit me? I don't know. We'll do it in a second. No, I'm going to do it right now. I remember seeing a tall boy in there. So I don't know about you, but I like beer in any matter. So just a little bit to kind of get these veggies going. Look at that. I mean, look at that. A little bit of veggie steaming in the bath. There you go. Take a sip for yourself. Oh, Budweiser, you are so good. Um, what else did I have to do in here? Nothing. I think we're good. A little seasoning. A little seasoning right there. Uh oh, we gotta get the eggs going. Now it's like a race. You make it fun, you know? You make it fun. Veggies are going. Crack these eggs open. If you like egg whites only, well then you're just a wuss. Go to LA. So here we go. I'm gonna do four eggs because I'm a fat person. That was not nice. I just like my food. I got no spatula, so I'll take a... I guess I'm taking a spoon. Just whip these up real quick. Come on, let's race, let's race, let's race. And here we go. Flip this a little bit, get that beer out of there. Throw that omelet in there, or the eggs. I like to just take the outside like this to get it a little looser. Looser. <laughs> I'm changing my garbage omelet into garbage mush, I think. That's the good thing about cooking. You know what? You change your mind, you want scrambled. All of a sudden you got scrambled. You know what I'm saying? I changed my mind. I'm temperamental like my girl. Sorry, honey, just kidding. So here we go. It's done. Turn off the flame because the thing about eggs is when you turn off the flame, they're still cooking pretty big, pretty hard, pretty long. So if I knew where my Tabasco sauce was, I'm thinking it's in here. There it is. I'm gonna throw a little Tabasco in there at the end. And you know what's really nice actually is green. The green is really good. I just don't have any right now. A little Tabasco. Okay, and here's my last, my finale, my topper. Uh, you're gonna think I'm crazy once again. I'm throwing a little A1 on that baby. Cause it's just, you know. Am I allowed to say A1? Just a little bit. Right there. Look at that. I mean, come on, that's loving right there. All right, so one last thing, cheese. You usually do this right when you turn the flame off. But once again, I don't like my melted completely. There's no rules here. There are no rules, so you do whatever you like. I'm gonna do it like that. Grab a plate real quick. 
since you know I have a lot of plates, I'll use this one. Nice variety for you guys. Uh, spoon. Uh, let's go with the spatula. Flip this like that. That's it, a pile of garbage omelet, and that's our, well, it's now scrambled, but that's what it's supposed to look like, a big pile of garbage, literally. And I promise you, it's gonna taste like, let's hope not garbage. Good stuff, this is good stuff. This, my friends, perfect for after a skateboard hockey uh, journey down the road or just a hangover, so God bless, punk ass chef.